Hey guys, it's time to check out the performance of the Google Pixel with the official Android 8.0 Oreo installed against uh, the Galaxy S8. So we'll see how the app's opening speed is, how the multitasking is. Google says that it boots up faster than uh, the previous Nougat. So uh, let's see how this will go against the Galaxy S8. Okay, so starting off from a boot up comparison, uh, three, two, one, go. Okay, we got that little menu for the bootloader, but let's see, even with that, if it's going to win or not. And okay, felt a vibration, Google logo, oh my god, it really does boot up faster, so uh, even with the older, um, you know, the older hardware, but newer software, the Pixel uh, beats the Galaxy S8, so that's a, a new thing, definitely. Originally, the Pixel on the Nougat was slower than the Galaxy S8 in boot up test, but you can see 8.0 Oreo definitely providing uh, some improvement there. Time for some apps opening tests, so starting this with the phone dialer, 3, 2, 1, go. And as you can see, the Google Pixel was faster there, tiny bit. Moving on to settings. And again, Google Pixel faster there. So far, so good. Let's check out some third-party applications. So uh, we're going to launch a game, which is the Riptide GP. Uh, one of my favorite games currently to play on phones. Let's go. And okay, seems like... The Galaxy S8, of course, it has a newer chipset. I mean, it's a 2017 phone. This is still a 2016 phone. Uh, but you can see the difference there. Next, we have Uber. And faster on the Galaxy S8. Moving on to Pinout. And this time, the Pixel is quicker. So, gotta say, I mean, Pixel is definitely faster uh, with the 8.0 Oreo. Smash hit. And... The Galaxy S8 quicker. Both phones are going back and forth. Moving on to the Twitter application. And okay, quicker on the S8. What about Snapchat? And felt just a tiny bit faster on the Galaxy S8. Next we have Beach Buggy Racing, another game. And let's see the loading times on both phones. Galaxy S8 done. And the Pixel took some time there. Checking out Instagram. And I think the Pixel was faster. Uh, okay, I think both phones have got the latest feed. Let's check my profile. A uh, little quicker on the Google Pixel. So, gotta say, Pixel is definitely improved uh, with the help of the latest official update. It is performing really good uh, compared to a 2017 phone. So, lastly, we'll be launching the cameras on both phones. So, here we go. And you can see the Galaxy S8 was quicker there. Time for some browsing action. So I have a fresh Google Chrome browser opened up on both phones. So first website will be facebook.com. And uh, as you can see, the Pixel is done, followed by the Galaxy S8. Next we have apple.com. Okay, let's see, can the Galaxy come back or not? Okay, both phones are on the website, but the Pixel is done, followed by the Galaxy S8. So scrolling through the website looks really smooth on both phones. So clean win for the Pixel there. Moving on to the RAM management. And this is the favorite part because the Pixel is really terrible when it comes to RAM management. So it's the way Google has optimized it. So phone dialer, okay, feels like a refresh on the Galaxy S8. Moving on to settings. Settings also got refresh. Uh, Pixel is still keeping up the things in the memory. Moving on to Riptide GP. And that also got refresh. Next up is Uber. Okay, Uber is still there. Pinout. Okay, Galaxy S8. Good stuff. And Smash Hit. And it's still there. Still there on the Pixel. Let's see, let's see. Going back to Twitter. So far, so good. Snapchat. Got one more game, Beach Buggy Racing, and that got refresh on both of these two phones. So far, only one refresh for the Pixel, and I think about four uh, refreshes on the Galaxy S8. Uh, Instagram is still there, so that is nice. And lastly, we are back to the Google Chrome and that is still kept there. So I recently got a big software update for the Galaxy S8, so maybe that's why 
it is uh, doing some refreshes because normally it is performing good uh, like in the last test we did uh, but I have to say pixel is really really improved RAM management is improved boot up times is faster than the Galaxy SA which means that it's going to be the most faster phone fastest phone uh, of all the Android phones that I have when it comes to booting up although I'll be comparing it to uh, the iPhone 7 uh, really soon so make sure you stay tuned for that so even after a year the pixel is still rocking some good stuff good performance and I can't wait for the pixel 2 to come out and uh, pixel XL 2 because uh, I don't like the bezels that we will see on the normal pixel 2 so yeah uh, I will be covering up some news for the pixel 2 really soon so for all that content make sure to subscribe and I will see you guys in the next one peace out